so what exactly we are going to discuss in this session so in this session we are going to discuss how to install the sql developer so now you can say that what is sql developer sql developer is nothing but uh, it's a gui form where you can see the tables and objects and whatever operation you can do on the oracle database that you can do on the gui form rather than the sql plus that is the black screen in the our last session we have seen the uh, we need to work on the black screen so instead of that we have a one alternative that is sql developer so what sql developer will do sql developer will replace that black screen of sql plus with the gui so what will happen there will be one sql plus and sql plus is connected with the oracle database so what it will do it will fire the commands or whatever the query you are from, uh, you want to fire that query you can fire on the sql plus and that sql plus query will go to the oracle database and whatever the operation you that query want to do within a internal uh, oracle logic or i can say the engine it will do and it will return to the sql developer and you will see that result on the sql developer so in short if you want to work on the gui form then you have to use the sql developer so this is the thing which we are going to discuss in this session guys so let's begin so guys let's understand how to install the sql developer so in order to uh, download the sql developer you have to go onto the google and you need to type the sql developer download and as soon as you click on the search you will get this type of link now you have to click on this link and then once you click on this link then you you will be redirected to oracle official website from there you can download the sql developer depending upon the your operating system and processor whether it is 64 bit or whether it is a 32 bit so uh, download as per the your requirement and the jdk is, is not installed then please please install the jdk as well otherwise what you can do you can download this one and you can install it so i have already installed it okay let me show you where exactly i have installed it so let me show yeah this is the i have installed and i have extracted when you download the uh, sql developer then you will get the one uh, zip file so you have to unzip it and you have to put in the c drive so let me show you where exactly you need to put so you just you what you need to do you need to go to in the G, uh, c drive then app and under app you have to put the sql developer okay guys so over here you need to put after that what you need to do you need to go to inside this filter after that you have to click on the right click and then create a shortcut so i have that i have already done so this is how you will get the shortcut because you will frequently use this uh, sql developer let me click on this uh, sql developer so it will be get launched in a moment so guys this is the uh, sql developer is launched okay now what you need to do you need to go on to the this button this plus sign so just click on this plus sign so you will get this kind of window once you will get this kind of window just you need to press on the connection just press on the ok button now this kind of window will be get launched so what you need to do you need to just <coughs> type over here uh, let me uh, show you already which i have download uh, created the connection so what you need to do you need to create the uh, connection name you can name any anything okay xyz over here after that what all the user you have unlocked it at the time of installation of our oracle database we have unlocked the scott uh, and the uh, uh, our hr user and the sys and system so any of them you can choose it so right now i have chose the hr user now you need to enter the password one two three four five six what we we have given the password at the time of oracle database installation not this is we are not setting okay so at that time we have given so that uh, password you have to give now uh, you have to give the over here local host okay and then your port is the uh, 1521 it is fixed now after that you have to give, click on the sid sid this is nothing but this uh, database name it, you remember at the time of installation oracle installation i have given the orcl so that you have to give over here so once you have you fill this information just you need to click on the test so once you click on the test 
you will be get verified whether the our SQL developer has properly installed or not so I have already done that just I need to click on the connect otherwise you what you can do you can directly click on the next button as well or I can say uh, the connect button as well now as you can see over here let me wait for some time it will be get opened in a moment So as you can see over here, this is the SQL developer launched. Over here, you can write anything, whatever you want to write. Means queries, okay? Create table or you want to retrieve some information from the table or whatever you want to do, you can do over here. So this is how you need to write the uh, you need to install the SQL developer. Let me show you one uh, SQL query, which I can write very quickly select a star from employees so this is my first query which I am writing over here and if you don't understand this what exactly this query is so don't worry about that I will explain in a detail in upcoming sessions okay so what is wrong oh yeah uh, from from I have written two times over here so forget it Now you can see over here, I have, uh, there, there are few already given the tables inside the Oracle database at the time of installation. Okay guys, so this is how you need to install the SQL developer and uh, yeah, you, you need to uh, do the query like that and guys if do we do not install the sql developer then what will happen let me show you that earlier uh, you have to go to the sql plus sql plus over here and you have to work on this black screen let me type the hr and then password one two three four five six now over here you can see select a star from employees so this is how so now you can see it, it's a very like uh, scrambled and weird kind of thing okay coming which is and it, we cannot even identify which what is the column name what is the data and everything so what you need to do you have to do lot of settings and all these things so we do not need to worry about all these things uh, and if you are interested then please let me know what all the settings it requires so set this uh, uh, sql plus uh, terminal or i can say the graphics or table properly so i will let you know in the comment box as well so please let me know if you are interested working on the sql plus or i can say i will make one video on that also but you i generally in nobody work on the sql plus so <clears throat> right now I'm uh, closing this window so this is how you need to work and in going forward also we will use the SQL developer only so I hope you have understood why it is required the SQL developer now and guys if you like the video then please hit the like button share it and if you want to get the regular update on my channel then don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you so much